वेलकम एवरी ओन टू आवर चैनल मैथमेटिक्स पाठशाला दिस इज एनदार प्रब्लेम अब सी एस आई आर यू जिस नेट जून टू थाउजेंड टोटी थ्री मैथामेटिकल सैंस एंड द कोश्चन आई डी सेवेन जिरो फोर जिरो सिक्स सेवेन सी द प्रब्लेम हेयर दिस इज अबाउट मेजर थिरी नो नीड टू वरी अबाउट मेजर थ्री मेजर थिरी दिस इज Uh, if we know the basic measure theory, then we can solve this problem. So there is a page written some basic result of measure theory. We will discuss later. First, let us see the question. Mu denote the Lebesgue measure on R, and mu star be the associated Lebesgue outer measure. And A be any non-empty subset of closed interval zero one. Then which of the following statements are true? Uh, it says that if both interior and closure of A have the same outer measure, then A is Lebesgue measurable. If A is open, then A is Lebesgue measurable, and mu is greater than zero. If A is not Lebesgue measurable, then the set of irrationals in A must have positive outer measure. And option four says that if mu star equal to zero. Then A has empty interior. See first, uh, what is measure? We should know about that. Actually, in R, Lebesgue measure is like to measure the distance of a set or length of a set. Suppose if A is a set which is closed interval A B. Then the measure of this set will be actually the length of this set, b minus a. So like this, we can find the uh, Lebesgue measure of a set. And there is a definition of measurable set. Uh, see any standard book. You can see G D Bera measure integration. And first to solve this problem, we only need some basic results uh, about measure theory. And I have just written these results here. See, result one. If A is uh, for a subset of R, the following are equivalent. A is number one says that A is Lebesgue measurable. Number two says that for any epsilon greater than zero, there exists an open set, say O, such that A is contained in O with mu star. O minus A less than equal to epsilon, and number three for epsilon greater than zero there exists a closed set F such that F is contained in A with mu star A minus F less than equal to epsilon. So if we can prove two or three, then we can say that A is Lebesgue measurable because two and three are uh, if and only if criteria for A to be measurable. See of result two. For A B subset of R, if A subset of B, then mu star A less than equal to mu star B, and mu star A union B less than equal to mu star A plus mu star B. Actually, the option two holds for countably many sets. It is called countable subadditivity. Option three says that if A and B are measurable, then its union A union B and also intersection are measurable sets. And option four is another sufficient condition. Of measurability, if mu star a equal to zero, then a is measurable. Then look at option result three. Every open and closed sets are measurable. This is some basic results which we need to uh, solve the above problem. Uh, option two says that uh, that I have just said now that measure actually like to find the length of that set. So if The set is closed interval AB. Then mu star AB will be length of AB that is B minus A. And also these interval sets are measurable. Any interval, say closed intervals or open intervals or semi-closed open, are measurable sets. Option three uh, says that uh, number three says that uh, mu star equal to zero if A is countable. So the measure of any countable set is zero. Then look at option, uh, uh, result four. If A and B are measurable sets, then mu star A minus B will be mu star A minus mu star B. So this is some basic results 
which we need to keep in mind now see the problem let us see the problem option one says that if both interior and closure of a have the same outer measure then a is measurable so that is says that for any set a it says that interior and closure of a have the same outer measure and outer measure is denoted by mu star a so here says that mu star interior a equal to mu star closure a now see here we can write uh, okay uh, see here interior a is open set and closure a is closed set we know that the interior of any set is open interior a is open and the closure of any set is closed set so by our one of one one of our result uh, any open set and closed sets are or uh, sorry uh, every open set and closed sets are measurable so the result is see here the result is our last result result 4 if a and b are measurable then mu star a minus b equal to mu star a minus mu star b this result now we will use so just write mu star a bar closure a minus interior a mu star closure a minus interior a because closure a and interior a are measurable so this will be our mu star closure a minus mu star interior a and by our given condition 1 this is equal to 0 and now look at result result 2 number 4 that mu star equal to 0 implies that a is measurable so so our from here closure a minus interior a is measurable and also see our a minus interior a is subset of closure a minus interior a so by another result written here mu star a minus interior a is less than equal to mu star closure a minus interior a and this is equal to 0 and also the outer measure of any set also greater than equal to 0 so from this we have mu star a minus interior a equal to 0 and so by result written here we have a minus interior a is measurable this is a measurable set actually living measurable we are not uh, saying living measurable rather saying only measurable so if we write the set A as interior A union A minus interior A so since interior A is open set so it is measurable and we proved that this is measurable and also there is a result that the union of two measurable sets is measurable so by this result a is measurable so option one is correct option then look at option two if a is open then a is direct measurable this is one of our result and then we need to prove that mu a greater than zero now see let us uh, given that a is open set given a is open and take any x belongs to a since a is open x is an interior point of a so there exists a delta greater than 0 such that 
open interval x minus delta x plus delta is a subset of A. So by one of our result, we have mu star we have mu star this open interval x minus delta x plus delta is less than equal to mu star a since a is measurable we can write this mu star a as mu a when a set will be measurable then we write mu star a by mu a only and by another result this is the interval so the length this will be x plus delta minus of x minus delta that will be our 2 delta so what we get now mu a is greater than equal to 2 delta and we have uh, there this delta is greater than 0 so this will be greater than 0 so again this option 2 is correct option now look at option 3 if a is not uh, Lebesgue measurable, then the set of irrational in A must have positive outer measure. So we are given that A is not measurable. A is not measurable. This is given. This is for option three, and this was for option two, and option one for this. So given that A is not measurable. Uh, if possible let the set of all irrationals in A must have positive uh, uh, oh we have to show that the set of uh, ir uh, irrationals in A must have positive outer measure so let us first write A equal to A equal to in this way that A intersection Q union A intersection I Q means the set of rationals and I means the set of irrationals so A can be written in this way and see option 3 says that uh, this mu star A intersection I the set of all irrational in A this should be positive outer measure so this should be greater than 0 we have to prove that so if possible let if possible let mu star a intersection i is equal to 0 then see here then this mu a a is measurable so we can write mu a instead mu star a so this will be less than equal to our mu star a intersection q plus mu star a intersection i Uh, this is uh, actually we are given uh, a is not measurable sorry so we have, we have to write mu star a uh, now this is uh, by our result uh, result 2 number 2 the mu star a union b less than equal to mu star a plus mu star b so we can write this and see this a intersection q is subset of q so this is a countable set and also there is a result result 3 number uh, 3 that mu star equal to 0 if a is countable so this must be equal to 0 because the measure of any countable set is 0 outer measure and also by our hypothesis we have uh, suppose that this so this equal to 0 so what we get mu star a less than equal to 0 so mu star a will be equal to 0 because mu star a always greater than equal to 0 so merging this we get mu star a equal to 0 and which implies that a is measurable by result 2 number 4 so this will imply that a will be measurable but 
our given hypothesis is a is not measurable so this is a contradiction so why this contradiction came because we have suppose that mu star a intersection i equal to 0 so this is not possible so we must have so we must have this mu star a intersection i greater than 0 that means the set of all irrational c in a must have positive outer measure so our option 3 will be also correct option the set of all irrational c in a must have positive outer measure now look at option 4 if mu star a equal to 0 then a has empty interior so let us now suppose that mu star a equal to 0 of this option 4 this is given that mu star a equal to 0 we have to show that interior a interior a equal to 5 this is what we have to show so if possible let interior a oh no need to let just uh, applying this that interior a is subset of a so by our result interior one of our result mu star interior a less than equal to mu star a and mu star a equal to 0 so our mu star interior a equal to 0 and if interior a not equal to 5 then we must have mu interior a greater than 0 by our option 2 we already have proved that that for any open set since interior a is open set for any open set a mu a should be greater than 0 since interior a is open set since interior a is open set uh, then uh, mu interior a should be greater than 0 but uh, our we get mu interior a equal to uh, mu star interior equal to 0 actually mu interior equal to 0 so this is a contradiction so we must have interior a equal to 5 uh, let us now repeat one time the option 4 we have to show that interior a equal to 5 if interior a not equal to 5 then interior a uh, interior a will be an open set and uh, outer measure or measure of interior a should be greater than 0 by option 2 which we have proved already uh, but we get here mu interior a equal to 0 so which is the contradiction so interior a must be 5 because interior a not equal to 5 will imply uh, mu interior a uh, should be greater than 0 which is a contradiction so we get that if mu star equal to 0 then a has empty interior that is interior a must be 5 this is also correct option so here option 1 2 3 and 4 are the correct option just mind it in here option 2 if a is open so uh, given a is a non empty subset of 0 1 so if a is 5 then a is open and mu a equal to 0 uh, because the uh, outer measure or measure of null set equal to 0 but if any but uh, for any non empty open set the measure of that set should be greater than 0 so here it is written that a is non empty so option 2 is correct and option 1 2 3 4 are correct options thanks for watching